What can happen if we just take the time to care and listen? Jolene Tovis reports. It is a story of goodwill and helping a person in need. Over a month ago, a woman and her son were wrongfully evicted from their home and left to wander the streets with a suitcase in hand. The mother and son are participants under Gura's Section 8 program and were renting a home in the Harmon area when their landlord informed them that their Gura contract was terminated and they needed to move out. With nowhere to go, the two wandered the streets, moving from village pavilions to sidewalks and parks, wherever they could find shelter, not knowing what to do, until one family's act of kindness. Karina Sue and her family opened their hearts and their home to the woman and her son, helping them resolve the matter. But how was something like this able to happen? Guru Director Michael Duenas. We became aware of a potential program violation, that, uh, uh, and uh, our staff discussed it with the head of household and basically said this has to be resolved. Uh, um, and if, if, if it can't be resolved satisfactorily, then we have to terminate you from, from the program. But according to Duenas, the matter was resolved and it was determined that there was no need to terminate the family from the program only informing them that she must move from a smaller unit to a two-bedroom unit. He says that's where things fell apart. The landlord uh, was also involved uh, in, in these discussions. and uh, The woman was, was basically informed that she had to go conduct a search and look for a, a two-bedroom unit. Uh, it seems that the, the landlord decided that um, to, to terminate their, uh, their lease without notifying us. And um, unfortunately, though, the family did not notify Gora either. But the landlord continued to collect rent from the Section 8 program despite terminating the lease. It wasn't until uh, later on um, when uh, a concerned um, um, individual uh, contacted Gora and tried to get more information about what was happening. It was Karina Sue and her family that brought light to the situation. As soon as we realized what had happened, um, the family was given a, a two-bedroom voucher and, and instructed to go search for one. Um, they were able to find one quickly. As for the landlord who pocketed one month's rent, Gura has since taken the steps to ensure rent payments have been stopped, recover the payment paid out, and is no longer a landlord participant in the program. While Gura chalks this up to miscommunication, the happy ending can be attributed to an act of kindness. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Jolene Tovez.